Franklin, a 29-year-old teacher of a corporate era primary school and of a Helsha Park, Portmore, St. Catherine address, was reported missing to the St. Catherine South Police by her parents. Ms. Anglin reported left her house on Monday, May 13, 2024, about 5.50 a.m. en route to school and had not been seen or heard from since. An investigative team was assembled consisting of St. Catherine South Criminal Investigation Branch, led by the St. Catherine South Crime Officer and supported by the Communication, Forensic and Cybercrime Division, CFCD, Scenes of Crime and Criminal Investigation Branch Headquarters, CIB Headquarters. As part of the investigations, the team visited her community and her school and conducted a number of interviews. The team also utilized available technologies and forensic capabilities, which allowed for identification of a number of vehicles which were assessed and analyzed and with skill application of their training, identify a vehicle of interest. The driver of the vehicle was subsequently identified and taken into custody following investigations. Again, with the use of technologies, we were able to identify a location in Salt River in Clarendon as the last identifiable location that the Miss Anglin was in. As a direct result, a number of searches were done within sections of St. Catherine and Clarendon. On Monday, June 3rd, 2024, about 6.30 a.m., police made a discovery of human skeletal remains in a section of Salt River in the parish of Clarendon. It is still too early in our investigation to state definitively that it is Miss Anglin's body, and thus we await the findings of the forensic team. Given the weight of the evidence collected thus far, the suspect in the matter has since given a statement to the police admitting his involvement. I want to point out that this specific suspect was arrested and charged sometime about 2015 by the police for sexual offenses. He was also convicted in Antigua for sexual offenses and deported to Jamaica. We appeal to the public, if you have any information that can assist with this case and any other, please reach out to 119 or the nearest police station. This and other investigations in the past indicate the quality of the people and technology within